Good day! Uh, I'm on a real roll right now. Uh, I didn't think my last package would arrive in time, uh, but uh, it did. So I have five additional 2020 releases I'm going to show you. First up we have Succumb to Rot by the band Corpsest. Corpsest are a Finnish death metal band from Järvenpe Usima. Uh, they were formed in 2007 and their first full length uh, Abysmal Thresholds I had uh, picked up a couple of years ago but I sold it because I never got into it but I heard this on Spotify and it's a uh, very uh, very heavy uh, good uh, polished death metal quite brutal they mix it up uh, very good between very fast paced blasting and uh, slower doomier uh, not doomier but slower tempo uh, and but the drums are always powerful this one contains eight tracks uh, and it's uh, around 36 minutes in length and here we have uh, it was released by Dark, Dark Descent earlier this year. Here we have the track listing. So check out Corpsest if you want some powerful uh, death metal from Finland. <laughs> Next up we have this one, this is Ripped to Shreds with a record called Yubian, I don't know how you pronounce it, uh, released through Relapse Records. And Ripped to Shreds are, uh, was a one-man band before, uh, I discovered them in 2020 when they released their second full length, or his second full length, but now he has added some additional members it seems. Uh, Andrew Lee is the main guy and uh, this is excellent stuff contains eight tracks and while there is a track uh, very Nile inspired called scripture containing the supreme internal energy arts that render the practitioner invis invincible throughout the martial realm this is not uh, Nile death metal this is more dismember and tombed um, death metal old school Swedish death metal but uh, not Fred Esteby or Nick Anderson on drums, imagining if Dave Kuros or someone else of the 200 different male volume creation drummers put their spin to, on Dismember or Entombed stuff. It's fantastic. Uh, it contains uh, 8 tracks, uh, 36 minutes in length, and this will definitely be at the top uh, on my year end list so check out Rip to Shreds uh, Yuvian and also check out their earlier stuff because it's a very very good band <laughs> For some vinyl records, this is Sarkator, a uh, record called Alkahest or something, re released through Black Lion Records. Uh, and the Sarkator is another uh, band I've spoken about before. Uh, it's a bunch of young guys uh, formed in 2018 in Trollhättan, Sweden, released two excellent EPs uh, in 2019 and a very good death thrash. Uh, debut full length uh, in 2020 uh, awesome stuff and this uh, the second their second full length starts out as with a death thrash very intense and fast and furious on the track ascend but then they stop playing death thrash and go it it turns out to more heavy metal slower to mid paced some acoustic interludes and stuff, 
sounds nothing like the first track uh, and it's 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 very long it's almost one hour in length and the first time I listened listened I was very pumped up for the first track and then it just I didn't know what happened it just plodded along I it never picked up the pace uh, so I was very disappointed but I have listened to it several times and now I, I appreciate it. I wished every, every track was, were in the vein of Ascend, but um, uh, they are not. It's more heavy metal, uh, but the, the harsh vocals are still there, which reminds me, makes it a little bit similar to tri Tribulation, another Swedish band, death metal band turned gothic rock or something, but this is more heavy metal. Anyway, uh, I will... Uh, the, the track will not be Ascend, but, but check out Ascend or, and the other stuff, uh, the earlier stuff if you want Death Thrash, but if you like a good heavy metal with harsh vocals, you should check out this uh, record. From the death to the mountains, from a dream to a death, and from the stream to the furious fires, you would take me there. And next up we have Destroyer 666 newest album called Never Surrender, released through uh, Se Season of Mist uh, a couple of weeks ago. Uh, and uh, Destroyer 666 I've talked about a lot, I've shown all their full lengths on, in previous videos. They were formed in Melbourne in Australia in 94 and Never Surrender is their sixth full length release. First three were awesome. Did a little bit on Defiance, but the previous, the predecessor to this one called Wildfire was very good. And I think this one is slightly better than Wildfire. Um, it's black and thrash with some black and roll and uh, lots going on. Uh, but it's very, very good. Uh, not as good as the first three, of course. Uh, but uh, very good. And uh, it's nine tracks, 40 minutes in length. You get a big poster of the album artwork. You get a printed inner sleeve with lyrics. And you get got two uh, refrigerator magnets. And the record is looks black on camera, but it's red and black marbled, kind of a. Uh, yeah, you could it anyway, uh, good stuff. Lastly, we have one of my absolute favorite releases on this year. Uh, I have had this CD for a long time, but I was going to show it in my next to last video but can't find it but now i have found it and also got the lp version this is molder Engr engrossed in decay uh they uh, band the band uh, are from shorewood illinois formed in 2017 and this is their second full length i haven't heard their first one but we'll try to pick it up. But this, this their second full length was released by Prosthetic Records. Uh, contains 10 tracks of very, very catchy uh, old school death metal in the vein of autopsy and obituary and that kind of stuff. Very catchy. And the production is excellent. Uh, fantastic 43 minutes of music. Uh, definitely going to be in the top uh, of my year-end list. And this one uh, came on bone white vinyl, but uh, I think it's more yellow. There are some maybe bone white stuff on it. And you get a some kind of lyric sheet 
And there you have the three band members. Dominic, Aaron and Kyle. Excellent music. Molder. Engrossed in decay. And that was it, uh, and this will be my last update before uh, next week or something. I will do my end of the year list because I have I haven't ordered anything that I'm waiting for except one thing, but I don't think it will arrive. But have a nice day. <laughs>